<laughs> Lay's chicken and waffles. Chicken and waffles. I have never heard of this before. I guess it's really popular down south and then some restaurants like and in California and places have them, but yeah. I um haven't really <laughs> ever tried this ever before and um, so I want to make it because we tried the chips and they taste pretty good and they smell good too they smell can you smell them they smell like uh, maple syrup um, and I guess there's a little bit of chicken flavor in it um, but I wanted to try the real thing and I know there's lots of different recipes out there but I picked this one on the all recipes website because it got um, a lot of ratings and a lot of stars. So I'm assuming it's a pretty good recipe and it looks pretty good. So um, I will link this recipe so you can find it too. But you are going to need eggs and heavy cream. I like to use Dairy Gold, heavy whipping cream. Uh, cayenne pepper, salt, black pepper. Flour, cornstarch, salt, again, this is probably for, like, maybe what you cover the chicken in? I have no idea. And this part, this part scares me. One quart peanut oil for frying. I cook a lot, and I really have never fried anything in my life because, well, it's not really good for you anyways, and I do like to try to eat healthy, but obviously, this will not be a healthy recipe. But it will be fun. Eight chicken tenders. Got my chicken over there. Kitty, no! Kitty, no. Not for you. Um, <laughs> mayonnaise, maple syrup. I have the Mrs. Butterworths, but I also have this um, butter pecan syrup. Uh, it's Michelle's. And it is really, really, really good. So I think I'm going to use this syrup instead. And um, horseradish, mustard powder, bacon, uh, cheddar cheese, sliced. I'm going to slice my own cheddar cheese. That's my favorite kind of cheese, the Tillamook. And um, it says get some frozen waffles, but no, nah, I don't do that. I like to make my own waffles um, with Bisquick, milk, and eggs. And then I will be using my cuisine or waffle maker over here um, <laughs> and kitties really really now no 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 yeah before we get on to the recipe I have to show you my cat creepy shirt thank you Kate for giving me the shirt it says meow or <laughs> never and I like it and it's cute and it's kind of hard to see because I'm holding the cam but, you know, what can you do? Oh, shirt. Um, <sighs> Bella, this is not okay. And people watching this video won't think I'm a very good cook for letting my kitties hop up on the table whenever they want to. Get down. Good kitty. And that right there is a really good kitty. Hong Cleo. You're waiting. <laughs> okay. Um, <laughs> all right. This is not a cat video. It's a cooking video. So, um, the first thing I am going to do is step number one. Whisk together the eggs, cream, cayenne pepper, salt, and black pepper in a large bowl. All right. So, I'm going to get this going. Let's pause the video. And um, we will be right back. Well, for you it'll be like in a second. For me it'll be like in a few minutes. Okay.
Harry is asking very nicely to please give her some bacon. She would really, really like some bacon, please. Yeah. Maybe later, Harry. Oh, sweet baby. Sweet baby.